Welcome to DeFi Crypto Today. Our topic today is Snowbank. Another um, Olympus DAO, clone, fork, whatever you want to call it. It's a copy. Okay. It's very, very, very new. Okay. Uh, it's barely a day old. I'm, I'm showing it to you just because there are going to be a zillion uh, copies of Olympus DAO coming in the next few weeks and months. You're going to see that. The, the Olympus DAO created something new in DeFi, and I like to call it DeFi 2.0. Okay, it's a revolution in terms of the structure of DeFi protocols. Okay, it works super well with uh, Olympus DAO, Wonderland, and Climate DAO. So a lot of people said, "Wow, maybe we should do that for our protocols too." And some of the copies or forks, whatever you want to call them, are going to be honest <laughs> protocols and some might not be and they might just be scams to try to steal your money. So I want you to try to uh, resist the urge to jump in too early and take, uh, relax, sit down, Okay, cool down a little bit uh, because the APYs are going to be astronomical. You're going to see here it, it's a ridiculously high APY. Okay, and you might get burned. I don't know who is behind Snowbank. It's an anonymous team. They actually even tell you they're anonymous. Okay, uh, and, and the, the risk is fantastic. The risk is just about as high as the APY. Okay, it might be a good project, but it's too early to tell. And do you really need to risk your money on this now? I mean, you have Olympus DAO already, uh, Wonderland and Climate DAO giving you a, a very high, very fantastic APYs already. And those are like uh, a lot more established than these little uh, copies. But I'm going to show it to you anyway, so you know what it's about. And you make your own decision. Okay, so they all gonna call themselves decentralized reserve currencies because that was the uh, the gimmick that was uh, sold by uh, Olympus DAO. Olympus DAO uh, says they're the uh, decentralized reserve currency. So no, everybody's gonna say that. Okay, and uh, that's what you're gonna see. You're gonna see it on Avalanche, on Phantom, on uh, Binance Smart Chain, on Polygon, on every network imaginable. Uh, they are gonna say decentralized reserve currency, just because they want to try to get some of the glory of uh, the Olympus DAO project. Okay, sometimes that may be warranted, sometimes not. Okay, you have to decide. All right, so let's look inside and see what's going on. I did not connect my wallet. I don't trust it. <laughs> so we're on the dashboard right now. Okay, you probably noticed there's a lot of numbers here. Okay, that's the APY this second right now. Uh, for those that don't know, these are three quadrillion, 342 trillion eight hundred and seventy five billion eight million seven hundred and forty two thousand eight hundred and five percent that's not gonna last very long okay you can see also that the runway is only 94 days so they don't expect to be able to maintain this ridiculously high uh, APY for more than 94 days and I expect a lot less a lot less than that okay uh, that's what they claim is their treasury balance. See, I, I'm not. Sh I don't know if these numbers are real or not. I would have to check in the code and make sure they didn't uh, trick the numbers or whatever. You know, it, it it's not audited. It's not audited. They claim to be a straight copy of Olympus DAO, but who knows, right? And they look to me like they copied Wonderland because they're on Avalanche also. And the layout looks very, very much like Avalanche. So I, I think they copied the code from uh, from Wonderland. Okay. 
So if you look at the staking page, you get, uh, for some reason, they, can't, they don't have enough space to put the APY number in full. So it's missing the leading three here. <laughs> current TVL is supposed to be 40 million at the moment, and they have a current index of 1.12. We're not connecting our wallet. We have uh, very steep discounts on the minting, as if this was not enough. Okay, you could get a discount on the token on top. Uh, they show you where to buy and, and, and so on. And apparently they're gonna add some new features like borrowing, whatever uh, they're gonna do with that, I don't know. And they're supposed to have an SP, uh, SB Pro uh, maybe they want to do like Olympus Pro. I, I don't know yet. I don't know yet. There's not a ton of information. The, the, uh, if we look at uh, the documentation, it's, uh, it looks like it's been copied from Wonderland. Okay. Um, and the, this is the part that I want you to focus on. My favorite is audits. And they are telling you now that Snowbank is currently unaudited. They say it's a fork of Olympus DAO on the Avalanche network. Audits will occur at a later stage. And I really like the last two words here. Stay cautious. So they're even warning you. Okay? That something bad just might happen. I don't know. Is that going to be a self-fulfilling prophecy? Are the poor people that are invested in this going to lose their shirt on this? Are they going to lose their investment? I really hope not. But I don't know. This doesn't give me a lot of confidence in this project. Okay. At least if they, they told me that they ordered an audit from a reputable auditor and we can double check that. It is say, okay, we have an audit pending at Paladin, let's say. Paladin is a famous auditor. Or at Certic, or God knows where. Right? At least, I would say, okay, I know an audit is coming. And I can verify with the auditor that it's true. Right now they say, an audit uh, will occur later. Okay, sure, I, I, I have to take your word for it. And who are you? Okay, all these people are anonymous. Uh, if you look at the anon, you'll see what I mean. Who created Snowbank DAO? Right here. Snowbank DAO is a fork of Olympus on the Avalanche Network. Our team is mostly anonymous. Mostly. I don't even know if there's one guy in there that is not anonymous who they don't mention anything. It's born of the DeFi community. Sure, we aim at becoming a decentralized autonomous organization. So they're not a DAO yet. Although the name says DAO, it's not a DAO yet. Okay, so if you're a token holder, you can't vote on anything. Okay, you can't decide on anything yet. And we are actively working towards that goal. Sure. Uh, their word against uh, whatever, right? All right. So... They do have a little Twitter page, okay, there's already 9,000 followers, so in terms of community size, that's not bad for a brand new protocol, but, okay, and here they say, uh, you know, the banking, and treasury, la la la, and so on, they say that uh, the SB, SB is the token for Snowball, MIM pair was the number one trading pair on Trader Joe uh, on 12 hours ago. This it says here 12 hours. Okay, sure. Uh, that doesn't mean okay that the protocol is good, right? It just means that a lot of people decided to trade this for good or bad. Okay. Uh, I don't know what's going to happen in the next few days, few weeks, or, or, or and so on. So we'll see, right? And here they, they were talking about the the ignition phase and whatnot. So, but if you look, okay, that, that that's it. There's nothing else in this Twitter. It just started November eighth, 
and we're November 9 where I'm at, I am right now recording this. Okay, it's a day old. The Twitter is a day old. I don't know how they managed to get 9,000 people on this in a day. I mean, they're really good, right, at getting people excited. They do have Discord as well. There's several thousand people on that also. So you can check it out if you want. They are listed on Coin CoinGecko. Okay, price is very volatile as is expected on this type of project. So that's not an indication of anything, except that uh, as you can see, uh, trading started on November 8th. Way too early for me. Personally, I would not put my money in there now. I don't care if it's three quadrillion uh, percent. Okay, uh, three quadrillion percent of zero, if they take all the cash out of the treasury, is still zero. Okay, I don't care. I mean, if you're really, you know, you're one of those guys that like to do bungee jumping and with your money, okay, and you're like, a, you know, you get excited by risk taking, okay, all right, enjoy the gambling. This is a gamble, okay? And I would, uh, I would not use my regular wallet on this, okay? I would create a, a different wallet on a different browser. So let's say, for instance, my main wallet is on Brave or Chrome. I would open another new wallet. I would install MetaMask on, uh, let's say, Firefox, okay? A tiny bit of money in there and say, okay, let's risk it, let's gamble. Okay, I put, I don't know, 50 bucks on this and see what happened, right? Look, I mean, it, it, this might be a real project. It might not be a scam. It looks like a scam from my personal opinion. But maybe it's real, okay? So if you want to take a chance, you want to gamble your money, you're free to do so. But be, take some precautions. Don't use your regular wallet. Okay, don't connect using your regular wallet. I, I suggest you, you try another wallet on a separate browser so they don't connect, uh, you know, with your regular wallet. Just in case there's malicious code on this thing. We don't know. It's not audited. And I'm not a coder. I'm not, I, I can't just go through the code and see, uh, is there anything malicious in there? First of all, it would take hours and days to, to check all this. Okay, you would need probably special software to check uh, that all the lines of code are identical and whatnot. I, I, I don't have those tools, right? And you, most of you probably don't, okay? Unless you're a coder already, okay? And you probably wouldn't be able to, to check this stuff easily. But I'm not, okay? So I'd rather not take chances, okay? I'm not such a huge gambler that I want to risk my money on this yet. Let's wait. What, what's the rush? Why, why the FOMO, you know? What, what's the fear of missing out on, on anything here? Three quadrillion percent interest? <sighs> I don't care. <laughs> I'm already making a ton of money with Wonderland, Olympus Dow. And, and climate out and other investments like Nexus. I love Nexus. I'm making uh, money hand over fist with this thing. Okay. Uh, there are lots of really good projects out there. You don't need to FOMO into the next shiny uh, high APY thingy that uh, copies Olympus Dow. Okay. Use your own judgment. Okay. Don't, don't, don't go nuts. Okay. As soon as you see a crazy high APY. Okay, uh, I mean, remember la last week I talked about Anubis DAO, supposed to be a copy of Olympus DAO, and they just uh, ran away with the cash. Okay, uh, they did it differently. They didn't start, the, the, they didn't even have a web page. Okay, <laughs> they were in a really big hurry to, uh, to uh, take your money. So be careful, that's my recommendation. Okay, and only use um, gambling money that uh, you, you, you're happy to lose. Okay, and uh, try, take precautions. Uh, you know, uh, I'll try a different wallet on a different browser. Don't use your main wallet. 
just in case there's uh, seriously bad code on, on this. We don't know. We don't know. It might be good. It might not. I don't know. All right. That's it for this video. If you like this kind of stuff, please like and subscribe. We want more people to view this channel. And ring the bell. This way you know when the next video is published. Download the free book. The link is in the description of every single video I post. And you can... It's very easy to download. You type in your name, your email address, you hit the submit button, and there's a big fat link that says download the book. If you miss that, okay, uh, you're not going to get it by email automatically. So I might have to fix that. Anyway, it takes time to fix all these things. So, uh, <laughs> but it works normally. Just hit the button. It works. If you miss the button, go to my Twitter page okay the link is also connected to the free book okay just click the link you get to the link tree page and there is the twitter link there okay dm me on twitter if you miss the book and send me your email address and i'll send you the book it's still free okay and if you don't want it for free well you can go to amazon give 5.99 to jeff bezos and jeff will send me a dollar later okay see you